from women. Let's get a lacking, guys. I know you're tired of seeing me in the same setting, but this is my face space and my comfort zone. And um, I don't know what else. <laughs> but today, we're going to be doing a little unpopular opinion. I need to obviously shower and all. So the twist to it is that I'll be doing my makeup while doing that unpopular opinion for those of you that don't know it's thanksgiving today so happy thanksgiving to everybody what are you thankful for hmm? Tell me. i'm thankful for jesus spared me or oh, god spared me with another day i'm thankful for my friends and my family that genuinely care about me i'm thankful for having a place to live having a job having clothes on my body it's just the little things yo but most importantly it's god and my family for sure anywho um yeah we're gonna be doing a it's not really a get ready with me but i'm gonna do my makeup because we haven't done that in a minute so we're gonna get that done and then we're gonna talk about unpopular opinions because i just thought that'll be a cute video idea so hopefully it does as well as i'm expecting it to even if it doesn't but that's okay because i like talking to you all so it's fine it's all worth it and then i also have to do a tiktok for products that i got from pattern beauty i think it is it's a hairline hair yeah a hairline um specifically for curly headed girls like myself so yeah i'm gonna go do that and then or well, i'll shower first then i'll do my hair to get that out of the way and then we'll get into this video but don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Because if you don't, you know what I'm gonna say. <laughs> but tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend. Because if you don't want to do it, what are you doing? You're missing out. That's what you're doing. And don't forget to turn the bell on like a ding dong. You know what I'm saying. But yeah, let's get into this video. I don't know if 
I should just stand up. Wait, but she's just like sitting. Or else, let me just take out the makeup that I need and then we'll get into it. And the time lapse it in so that I'm not taking too much of your time. You know? Somebody asked me, um, is it easy? Is it easier to come to America on an F1 visa or on a different visa? Honestly, an F1 visa is one of the hardest visas to get because you'll be coming here to study and it'll only be valid for the time that you have to study unless you find a company that is willing to sponsor you to stay and work for them other than that it's a mission to get an F1 visa because you have to find a sponsor you have to be eligible to stay in the United States and when you're looking into like different career parts I almost said fields career parts you need to make sure that it's something that they actually always hiring people for like example if you were to work in the medical field or if you were to work as an engineer or something they always look for those top careers I guess to like give visits to people after they study or whatever so yeah for girls it's easier to do the au pair program for guys it's a little bit harder but if you find an agency that can maybe help you like do summer camps or work at a resort, that would be a start. Okay. First things first, I'm gonna prime my face with this elf mint melt primer. I haven't put anything else on my face, I just washed my face when I was in the shower. So yeah. I don't know if you can see that, but that's how much I put. And I'm gonna just rub it on my face. Um, yeah, so that's how ooh, I don't really like the consistency because it's a little bit thick, so you have to use more primer than usual. Um, so yeah, that's to answer the first question. Guys, how's this fun for? <laughs> it's yeah, and it's not paying rent, like, I better get it together and be gone. Um, so yeah, can you see my face is sticky? But that's what the primer gonna do to get your face ready. Um, <laughs> next question. I got asked, um, do I eat brioni? I think it is. With <laughs> with a fork or a spoon? In all honesty, it depends on how I feel. I might be in the mood to eat it with a fork. I might be in the mood to eat it with a spoon. We just gotta see how I feel on that day. Um, I'm just opening my palette. I showed you all this in previous videos. Um, the Morphe one, the broken one. And then the Beauty Treats one from my best friend. So I'm trying to find space for everything to fit. Hopefully it fits. But yeah. Okay, and now I'm gonna go in with my e.l.f. Camo Concealer. It has a matte finish. This one's lighter than my complexion. And it's my first time using it. This is medium beige. And so is this one. But they have two completely different colors. Because this one's matte and this one's satin. Um 
my next unpopular opinion i'm gonna put that underneath my eye just to brighten my under eye and then guys i'm gonna put um foundation and all of that afterwards trust the process i'm not a professional so just trust the process i'm gonna let that sit and dry for a little bit um you already saw me trimming my eyebrows i don't really fold them in or anything because i have bushy eyebrows so i just leave it at that <laughs> i don't need to go crazy to um what am i trying to say can't even talk to i don't go crazy for trying to fold them in and all of that because i don't need all of that and um my unpop another unpopular opinion for me is that people like over hype america up don't get me wrong it's nice to be here and whatever but people over hype it up and people back home in south africa i'm not supposed to be using this brush this is a blush brush but <laughs> i'm using it because i got rid of my other brushes and now i'm struggling because i don't have any other brushes okay but anyway um yeah people can you see how bright that is yeah people overhype it up and they also make it more than what it actually is so in my honest opinion i don't like when south africans especially like i know a lot of you that watch my channel are south african so if you take offense to what i'm saying then you don't really know me like that you know i know it looks like a clown right now but Trust the process. Um, yeah, South Africans think that. Okay, so I'm gonna go in with this blush over here. I don't know if you can see it. This one over here. And I'm gonna mix it with a little bit of the brown. Um, they think that. I'm not gonna use this stupid brush. Where's my finger? They think that it's easier than it looks to be here in America. Guys, it's hot and people don't really understand it until they live here. Coming here on a holiday is completely different to when you live here. Because when you live here, you see how people really are. And uh, <laughs> I'm not saying that it's everybody, but yeah, it's, it's a learning curve and it's a big learning experience because when we came here on holiday in 2014, I had different thoughts and ideas on America compared to me being here like so long and actually seeing how it is. So I think that everybody needs to experience that. My cheeks look so weird. Everybody needs to experience that for themselves so that they can learn. Guys, hold that thought. Can't find one of the people, but anyway. Um, yeah, you have to you have to learn, and if if you're looking for a place to grow, then come to America, no problem. But if you're coming with high expectations, and you think, oh, I'm gonna get rich overnight, and oh, I'm gonna be able to do this and that, it will humble you. Eh? <laughs> it will really humble you. So yeah, that's my thought on it. And what I was saying that I hate the most is that people are like, oh, can you please buy me this? I'm going in with the Fancy Beauty Foundation. It is in shade 350. I hate when people are like, and I'm using the same brush for everything. So don't even judge, just shush, mind your business. Um, when people are like, oh, can you please send me this? Can you please send me that? Oh, can you please buy me this? Can you do this for me? Can you give me money? Can you borrow me money? Guys, in this year alone, so many people from back home <laughs> have asked me for money. And I was like, what do you think I am? What do I look like? Do I look like a walking ATM? Because if so, <sighs> help me see what you see, please. Because... I don't know, people just have this perception that if you're living in America, you're rich. Guys, the struggle is just as real as it is back home. 
Oh yeah, everybody just trying to make it and do the best that they can. So yeah, y'all need to get it together and learn that because wow. Um, yeah, um, on to the next thing because that was a touchy subject. Um, another unpopular opinion. Um, I have to think because I'm trying to focus on what I'm doing and <laughs> and say what I want to say. Oh, guys. Adult thing is that get out. Oh my goodness. The absolute get out. <laughs> I think that making friends in adulthood is so hard because you're not making friends to survive. And let me go into depth with what I'm trying to say. So, with making friends when you were a child, versus when you grow up and you become an adult it's a lot harder because when you're in school and you're making friends you're making friends for just that time like while you're in school if you stay friends afterwards all good and well but for the most part everybody is making friends in school just to survive because we all have to be there we've got no choice but to be there and we have to do the things that need to be done because we need to learn and we all just want to get out of it and progress with our lives so it's easier to make friends that way because we all just want to survive you meeting people that have similar likes and dislikes to you so it's like mm, i like this person i get along with them versus when you're an adult it's a lot harder to make friends because you both have busy schedules, you both have busy lives. I'm going in with this other concealer, it's the satin finish one. It's also by e.l.f. and it is a medium beige. Um, so yeah, it's hard to make friends when you're an adult because you all are both trying to figure out what you want out of life. You both have lives, you both have careers that you'll need to focus on. So it, it gets hard and people don't really understand that because they just think, oh, she got no time for me. Oh, she's not worried about me, you know, but guys, life is hard already. So it's like people don't need you to so add to their stress, you know. So, um, yeah, everything is the ghetto. To make friends is the ghetto. And yeah. Just be kind to people guys. Just be kind. It's not that hard. So everybody's just trying to make it. So just be nice. Okay, I'm going in with this bl not blush color, but it's like purpley. It's plum. So I'm going in with that around the edges of my eye. And if you're wondering why my concealer is still there, it's dry babes it's doing what it needs to do um so yeah next um <laughs> i think that in and out is overrated come at me if you want to come for me we can go i think that okay this place is only in california so Maybe I'm being biased, but Inanada is also only in California, but <laughs> I like Chick-fil-A too, but in my honest opinion, I think that there's this place called Data Chicken, as introduced to it by somebody that we won't name. <laughs> um, and guys, let me tell you, let me tell you, I'm going to put another color to like, Anyways, to provide a little bit. Um, I think that I'll go with one of these colors in this area, or maybe, yeah. Um, yeah, this place 
to me is so bomb in my honest opinion. You have to try it to know what I'm talking about. I ended up playing with this top color over here. Um, yeah, I love this place. It is so nice. They have like chicken sandwiches and all that. I know you all say, oh, you can't compare that to in and out because in and out doesn't sell uh, chicken sandwiches. They sell burgers and whatever. Not the point because you like to fight about whether in and out is better than Chick fil A. And yeah. Mm, let's play this card. Um, yeah, you like to, you like to fight. And say, oh, you don't like this in a chick fil a chick fil a chick fil a chick fil a Yes, everybody has their own opinion, so like what you like. But yeah, they've got chicken, they have like uh, chicken sandwiches, and then they have chicken tenders. So the menu, there's not a lot of a variety on the menu, which is fine because. The things still hit the spot, let me tell you. And it hits the spot that it needs to hit. So, I can get it any day. So, yeah, that's just my opinion on that. And that's all that. Oh, that is so bad. <laughs> oh, oh. I'm literally blushing, guys. I'm gonna put powder, so relax. It's not gonna be that bright the whole time, the whole time. <laughs> Look like a real clown. A real circus trolley. But yeah, I'm gonna use um, powder to blend it in more. Now that it's blended for the most part, it doesn't look that bad, but no bags. That ain't going so. Oh. Then I'm going in with this Wet n Wild Photo Focus Powder. It's Deep at Revenge. That's the color. It's 522B. Um, oh, the last time, let me tell you what happened when I use this powder. And I better not do it this time. The last time I used this powder to set my makeup. Yeah. Put it there in the T zone where we sweat a lot. I was getting white the last time. I used this powder. Now it's too dark. I'll figure it out. I need to get those powder puffs so that I can pat this baby in instead of using big brushes. Um, I was getting white, right? And this is just before. We had somewhere to go. <gasps> Didn't my white top get dirty? I was like, no, this is not the day for that. Why would you do that? Why would you do that? But my makeup still looked warm. And I had a feeling, oh damn, I did put it on my eyeshadow. I had a feeling that would happen. And I was like, no, I got this. I got this in the bag. Oh, bitch, you don't have nothing in the bag, Miss Girl. So, yeah. And I have to put powder in my T zone because I sweat a lot over there. And you don't need that happening. Now that part is looking darker to me. Oh, Lord. Oh, we're not done with the eyeshadow. Okay, so I thought that we are. I'm gonna put more love in my blush. Oh, dang. Um, okay, I'm getting distracted and I'm not saying my unpopular opinion. Um, what else? Guys, this is not an unpopular opinion, but you'll need to, if, if you have the means to, don't just take my word for it. If you have the means to, you should all travel as much as you can because there's so much more to life than where you grew up. Don't get me wrong, don't forget where you come from. But there is more to life than that. I'm going in with this Morphe. Morph. Morphe. How do you say it? Morphe? Morph. Whatever. Um, highlighter stick. 
this is what it looks like. I'm not stinging it all the way. Um, I'm gonna put some on the nose. Make this just shine just a little bit. And put them in the corner of my eyebrows. Because I'm living my life like it's golden. And then put some on the cheeky cheeks by the blush and the powder. Yeah. I know this is gonna be shiny in the in the sun. Um, but yeah, get out of your comfort zone and leave where you grew up because there's more to life than just being where you were born. And as I said, it's only if you have the ways and the means to do so. But other than that, don't just wait. I'm gonna use the Strobing Beauty Cheat Highlighter as well. Um, don't put pressure on your parents and say, we need to travel, we need to do this, we need to do that. If they can't do that right now, don't stress them into finding a way to make your dreams come true, you know? Try and, try and do it on your own. If you have help, all good and well, but guys, our parents already go through the most with us. Is this what I'm looking for? No, it's not. Fine. Hold on. Because I'm fighting for my life over here. I knew I didn't take out everything that I needed. I'm trying to see. I can't. See like properly on the camera, but I'm trying to see it's my face just to make sure. Yeah, our parents already go through the most. Anastasia, Baby Hills, and Raisy, I like that. Yeah, our parents already go through the most trying to do things that we all seem to do for us. It's time for us to do for them. You know? So yeah. <laughs> guys if you if you're thinking of going on your natural hair journey do it do it do it do it i will definitely encourage you the laxa was nice growing up because everybody wants to have straight hair but <laughs> natural hair is the way to go right now um I'm using this dark concealer again just to put here on my ass so that I can do my makeup. And by doing this it just brightens your eyes up a little bit more. Okay. Okay. I was already using this thing brushes because this thing of using all brushes for everything is not doing it for me. See? Plain and simple. I feel like I'm taking forever in the water then. But I could probably do it. So, I don't know if I, because she's such a team player. She'll be patient. She'll be strong. I'm sorry that I'm switching topics so much. But that's what we do over here. I'm going in with one of the gold colors on the wall. Morphe, morphe, whatever, tell it. Oh, that's how I'm part of my eyes. I need to learn how to do different <laughs> makeup because this is my go to, I swear. I always do this. Where can you land that wind? Somebody's angry. Angry birds. Next time, next time online. I know I don't have to keep on saying next thing, next thing, next thing, but I want to, okay? And I'm gonna do what I wanna do. Period. That's never mind. You're gonna say, yeah, 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 she's fine now. Going in with the makeup here, with a with a wild mascara. I'm gonna be putting on our lashes, so this just helps with 
have something to stick to a little bit more. Guys, I'm terrified to put my eyelashes up because I'm not eyelashes are gonna go. This I don't I don't care for this mascara because I feel like it doesn't do anything for me. And I needed to do something. At least make my eyelashes a shavings. But Oh, there was lash glue in here. Yeah, I was just in the room with have lash glue. These are the Taylor color. Ooh. I don't want to butcher it. Eyelashes. There you go. There you go. Um, I think I'm going to get it with the row. Why does one side look longer than the other? Like, this side looks naturalish and this one looks... Anyway, um, I'm gonna go with the first one. I'm gonna bend it so that I can cut the ends. Because I don't have that much eyelash. So I just cut, cut a little bit and I'm missing everywhere. Okay. Which eye was that? One of them. I know I already cut it. Okay. Um. I don't even know what number we on with the unpopular opinions. But guys, I think that. Okay. You don't. You don't always need me. Uh, I can't even talk. English bundles is depleted. Um. I don't think that you always need makeup. But um it's nice to do a little something different, you know? Every night. Oh no, why would I do that? The blue went everywhere. I hope it doesn't affect what I was trying to do. But I know that you don't need makeup to look beautiful or whatever. But it's nice to sometimes hold on. It's nice to sometimes do something nice for yourself. Cause there's already so much going on in the world. I always say this. And when I say you'll get something me. And there's already a lot going on in the world. So just be kind to yourself. Say so I don't know how this is gonna work. But I hope I don't miss this up. I'm trusting for my life. Oh, <gasps> why was the last? No. My feelings over. You keep doing it over and over. Keep calling me back. I'm just trying to get closer. You pulling me closer and closer. For me, you're like over and over. Cause you keep calling me back. This is making me so angry. Oh my gosh. Wait, let me just use my phone. Hold on. Guys, after fighting for my life, I got it on. I hate the feeling of fake lashes. Oh, I don't know how the girls do it. Oh. Made it though. The end is lovely now. But I was scared. Can I want me to be right? Oh, let's see. We're going to fight for our lives with the second dash now. Now you calling me special when you know I can't have you When I'm on to the next one, oh, now you want me to dress it, oh
guys. Chris. Natural. <sighs> my eyes feel heavy. <laughs> oh my gosh. Do we like them? I think they're gonna have to grow me because I don't know. I don't know how I feel right now. Let's just guys. So should we do a wing or should we just leave it? I think we should just leave it because I'm gonna end up messing up my my makeups. My makeups. Just a little touch up over there, over there. Okay. I mean, I got good wings on my eyes. Oh, my eyes feel so heavy. Heavy, heavy. This is a no, no bad, no bad shadow stick. This is a eyeshadow stick in the color champagne crystal. I'm just gonna put this in my corner on my eyes. Cause I usually put eyeshadow on. This looks cute, or rather. Now my favorite part. I don't know if I should just leave my lips like this and put lip gloss on, or if I should just put the brown lip lipstick and you know the brown lips that the girls do on TikTok. Yeah, that one. The one that the girls do on the tickly tucks. Okay, I'm closing everything because I'm practically done. It's just my lips that need to be done. And as you can see, I'm undecided. What do we do? Let's think. My opinion is the TikTok girlies eat up the brown lipstick every time. Every single time they don't miss. I'm using this. Oh, my fingers are dirty from the makeup. The Kiss Collection lip liner. Why would this that just happen on camera? People want me to be great. I'm gonna shop in a dollar. 
I gotta bounce back. No, when you sharpen it too much, then it breaks. I don't know, I think there's something wrong with my sharpener. But I was scared. This is the one last try. And if it doesn't work, then we're gonna use my next one. Okay. A new. A new better. Oh gosh. And this is brownie color. Okay. If this pencil doesn't want me to use it, I must just say that. Because it's actually in fire. It is Oh, I like this color. <laughs> We're eating the girls up right now <clears throat> with this Nova Beauty mm. lipstick. It's called Attached. Mm. <laughs> oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! I wish we had somewhere to go, guys. Where's the lid now? For the kiss collection thing? Bro. Should we add a lip gloss on it? Should we add butter gloss? Which one should we do? Should we do this one or should we do this one? I think this one. Ooh, we're eating it up right now. We're you ready to go? To the lounge. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness, guys. We're eating it up right now. Rocky Road and this is color brownie drop. Let me just say something. Let me just put it out there, right? God did that. My mother and father did that. I did that. Guys, I know I sound vain right now, but is this even real? Is she even real? Like what? I'm going to go eat it up on TikTok. Let me just open this here. Looking like a boy. Ooh, my hair's so wet though. Ooh, 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 ooh. <gasps> Did you just see that? to go my makeup never ever comes out like this but when I have nowhere to go and I'm sitting in the house my makeup's like oh, let me toilet us in 
What? Dude. Guys, I think I'm just gonna end up this vlog right here because I've got no words. But thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I told you in the beginning to do that. So I'm expecting y'all to do that already. But if y'all didn't, you better go do it. Tell a friend to tell a friend because if you don't want to do it, we will be back with more videos. Guys, next time I do an, un uh, an unpopular opinion, please can y'all actually contribute and ask me questions and stuff so that we can make this a little more interest uh, interesting. I know I spoke y'all's heads off, but was worth it or not? Cause I think it was perfect. Well, let me see. But I love you. I love you. I'll be back. Could you catch my vibe?